A man straps 50 pounds of fireworks to his back and soars 150 feet across the sky. But is it physics or pure fiction? Time for Mythbusters to light the fuse. To begin, they buckled up and headed straight to NASA. Because if you're going airborne with explosives, you want science on your side. The team built a prototype board, a rigid plank with fireworks attached in rocket formation. Into the wind tunnel it went and immediately failed. The board flipped 180 degrees like a rogue frisbee, zero stability. To fix that, they added larger aerodynamic fins. The upgrade passed the dreaded nudge test and finally held its ground in the tunnel. But out in the open? Disaster. On the first live launch, the rocket board spun out, veering wildly and crashing hard. With further tweaks, a redesigned board performed beautifully. The test dummy soared 250 feet high and landed 150 feet away. Encouraged, the Mythbusters scaled it up big time. They loaded 500 fireworks onto the full-scale rig and secured it to the launch pit. On ignition, the rocket man shot into the sky like a DIY Iron Man. The arc hit the 150-foot horizontal mark, myth confirmed. But the landing? Brutal. The dummy's head took a nasty hit, proving once again, what goes up with fireworks? Crashes down hard. So yes, fireworks can launch a person 150 feet, but you better not forget the helmet. Subscribe.